Hey sunshines and welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to wear these new sassy earrings that I just got. You're gonna see them in a future video and my new little red and white striped top I got from Natalie Attired. But I woke up this morning and it was 25 stinking degrees. <laughs> So I just threw on my Mr. Rogers-esque cardigan and I'm moving on with my day. But I was sitting down ready to film and for some reason in the back of my head I was like, go check the front porch and see if there's any boxes. And I'm so glad I did because my Be Kind by Ellen box was out there. There was a big um, shipping sticker right here but I ripped it off so I could show the front of the box because I thought it was pretty. So anyway, this is the Be Kind by Ellen box. It's put out by Ellen DeGeneres and it is a quarterly box. The first box actually was a fall box and they kind of were testing the waters, I believe. I really liked the first box and then when I got the notification that they were gonna do a spring box, I grabbed it. This one is sold out. It'll be interesting to see if they bring it back out for a second run. I don't know if they will, um, but I'm hoping it becomes a quarterly consistent box because I really did like the first one. If you're new to my channel, I just wanted to say, hey, my name is Christy and welcome. I'm so incredibly happy that you're here. Comment below if you're new so that I can welcome you personally in the comments and don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. All right, so let's talk about the Ellen Be Kind box. This is a lifestyle box and like I said, it's sort of Ellen DeGeneres' favorite things. Now this box I think was a little bit more expensive than the fall box. This one was $54.99 and then I paid I think $3.99 shipping. My total was like $58.00. Or $59 when it would all said and done so expensive just like a fab fit fun box it kind of fit in that same price range even a little bit pricier this is what it looks like and we're gonna open it and see what we think all right so when you open it, it says join me want to give even get even more involved learn about why we need gorillas sign up for the newsletter or donate to the ellenfund.org so Ellen has a um, fund that helps support the gorillas. There's like so few gorillas out in the world and I do love that. They um, focused on that in the first box. So this is what the next box looks like. There is a little pamphlet that says laugh, dance, and be kind. I really like sort of the message behind this box because kindness is so important these days. I feel like the world is just getting darker and darker and just a little kindness really can make somebody's day. All right, so the first thing I see in here is, ooh, ooh what is this? Something by Bida. It's a tumbler, so it's white. It's got this gray lettering on it, and then it's got a cool top. It looks like it's insulated. Oh yeah, this is nice. Oh, and they've got a sticker that says, skip the straw. This is really nice, wow. I don't have anything like this. I can see my husband like pilfering that for me because he's a big coffee junkie. I'm a tea girl. So this is by Bida, which I've never heard of that brand before. It's normally $29 and it's a 16 ounce stainless steel tumbler. It says Bida creates beautiful double walled vacuum sealed BPA free stainless steel cups made to take with you wherever you go. It's lightweight and it fits in any hand. It's super lightweight. Like that's I'm really surprised by how light it is. I actually really like this. I don't have anything like this. And I will use it. I think my family will use it. So that's a really great item. Okay, the next item in here is by West Rock Coffee Company. Again, I'm not a coffee girl. I fall in the minority of most of America probably. I'm a tea girl. Um, but my husband is a mega coffee guy, so he will be really happy to get something in a subscription box. I feel like my kids get stuff a lot, but he never does. So this will be fun for him. Let me see if I can find this. Okay, so this is a $3 value, and it says Meza Morning Blend and Rwanda Select Reserve Coffee. Let me see if it's pods. I would have bet that's probably what it is. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, oh yeah, there are pods in here. So there's two pods and two bags, which we have both kind of coffee makers, so those, either one will be fine. All right, and it says, Westbrook Coffee seeks to honor the farmers that produce traceable, high quality, co high quality coffee through direct trade. What began with a few farmers in Rwanda now spans across the globe, enabling you to positively impact families near and far through your cup of coffee. West 
Rock Coffee builds ethical and sustainable coffee, coffee supply chains from the farmer to the end consumer in 21 coffee growing regions. I like that and I like that this has a conscience, sort of like the Cosbox does, that they're um, really looking for companies that have like an ethical or social conscience. So I like that. I think my husband's gonna enjoy that too. All right, then the next thing, there's like a little card. It says, Calm, an offer from Be Kind. This is a two month trial. It's a $26 value. It says, Calm is the number one app for sleep, relaxation, and meditation from sleep stories meditations, music, masterclasses, nature scenes, and more. Help reduce stress, lessen anxiety, and improve focus. Join the 40 million people enjoying the audio content. Okay, so that's cool. The only thing I will say about this is I love it, but I'm hoping that I don't have to put my credit card in. I hope you can just get your two month trial and then be done. If you have to put your credit card in in case you forget to like cancel it, I feel like I'm not sure that I like it as much. Do y'all know what I mean? I don't know. Do you ever like sign up for a free trial and then forget to like unsubscribe and that's how they get you? <laughs> that's kind of what I'm wondering will happen with that. So we'll see. All right, the next thing in here, what is this? It's called Be Kind by Ellen Edition Rover. It's a book. Oh, look at that cute little puppy. It says they all deserve a home. Nearly all of the dogs in Rover once lived in a rescue or shelter. Many were living in a rescue when photographed for the book. Rover beautifully illustrates that healthy, smart, confident, loving, and talented purebreds and mixed breds are available to adopt from shelters everywhere. Okay, <sighs> I feel like I'm going down a negative path and that's very unlike me. Um, this is a $32 value. Um, I don't feel like this book is for everyone especially in this like Marie Kondo world that we're in where we're all trying to declutter. I have three cats, so I'm, they are all rescues. I didn't get any of them from like a breeder or anything like that. Um, but I don't know that this is a book that I'm super interested in, if that makes sense. I hope that doesn't sound cold because I love animals and I do believe you should get them from the shelter. I don't know though. This is not my favorite item to get in a box just saying okay oh gosh sorry guys all right then there's another layer underneath oh there's something by alex and ani things are looking up okay so this is by alex and ani and it um, benefits the ellen fund oh i love now i love this so this has got the gorilla on it which raises awareness for um, the almost extinction of our gorillas. Let's read about it and see what it says. So the Ellen Fund bracelet, Alex and Ani created meaning, create meaningful eco-conscious jewelry and accessories to positive, positively empower and connect humanity. This year, they partnered with the Ellen Fund to help build a future for gorillas. For each bracelet purchased, Alex and Ani will donate 20% of the purchase to the Ellen Fund. You can purchase these bracelets at, at alexandani.com. So they're $38. I like that. And it does have the little gorilla charm on it. That's a cool little item. I like that. I think that's fun and interesting. And I like that better than I liked the book to be honest okay something fell all right the next thing in here is a candle and you can barely see it it's matte black but it says be kind mm. oh that smells good okay that has like almost a little bit of a cologne scent like a clean man out of the shower this is the montecito calendar cal candle i can't read today what's my problem i feel like because i'm being negative like i don't know what to do Sorry. Okay, the candle was designed by Ellen herself with the scent she personally curated. It was made in California with a modern black ceramic design and named for the town that's close to her heart, Montecito. It smells so good. It's not like strongly of like a men's cologne. It just has a, like a fresh scent with just an end note of like a clean smelling man. Yes, yes. I'm gonna love smelling... Uh, burning this in my bedroom because I feel like a lot of times I burn like girly scents and my husband's probably like whatever this is gonna be good okay I like that and it's a $28 value all right things looked up a little bit good job all right and then there is a box of honey nut cheerios I did hear about this 
This is just like a free thing. It says, be sure to open your mini box as one lucky Be Kind subscriber will get something extra special. So I did hear that one lucky winner is gonna get a golden ticket in this box and it's worth $5,000. So let's see if I got the golden ticket. Yeah, there's no ticket in here. Darn, darn, I needed that $5,000. Anyway, okay, that's all right. I hope somebody gets it that really needs it because I think that would be a great story. All right, and then there's one more thing in here. Let's see if I can find it. Fell to the bottom. These are playing cards. It's a deck of cards. We paid $54.99 for this box. Um, custom Ellen playing cards. They're worth $9.99. Um, Ellen has a love of playing cards, especially poker. With quality playing cards as top priority, Ellen has custom made a special set just for you subscribers. Theory 11 is the largest producer of luxury designer playing cards. I mean, we'll use them. We do family game nights, but I don't know. What are you guys thinking of this box? I don't think it's a bad box, but for $54.99? Do you think it was worth it? I did really love the tumbler. I will use that. I mean, we'll use the playing cards, but mm, I don't feel like they're worth $9.99. Maybe good ones are. I mean, we got a box of Cheerios. A candle, I thought the candle was good, but you get those in a lot of boxes, but I love the smell. I think it smells really good. I did like the Alex and Ani bracelet. Um, but I just, I'm not sure how I feel about this book. I know I am sure how I feel about it. I don't like it. <laughs> um, I don't know. I guess I'm just not like a picture book coffee table girl. And if I was, it might not be a dog. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. You guys tell me what you're thinking about this box. Do you think it's worth the price? Um, let me know. I will say that I'm gonna probably stick with this box for a little while if they continue it because I'd like to see how they grow, but I'm just not sure that this one was my favorite. Okay, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts and I will see you tomorrow for a future video. Bye-bye.